Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Haris and you're watching Possible Now. So guys, today I'm going to guide you about how you can double your FPS in Fortnite Chapter 6 by applying these simple steps. You just need to watch the video till the end and if you're new on this channel, kindly subscribe to the channel, like this video, share it with your friends. And without any waste of time, let's start the video. So guys, method number one is open your settings and go to the Game UI tab scroll all the way down to find latency debug stats and make sure this is turned off disabling this setting reduces the number of background processes affecting your game eliminating lag and fps stutters next navigate to the audio tab and scroll down to subtitles click on the option buttons and follow these steps turn subtitles off set text size to your preference Change the text color to white, set text body to none, adjust background opacity to clear. By turning off these unnecessary subtitle related processes, your game will feel much smoother and faster. So guys, after that method number 2 is adjust visual effects. So for this you need to press the windows key plus R to open the run dialog box. Now here you need to type system properties performance.exe and click ok under the visual effects tab select adjust for best performance manually check the following options to keep essential visuals animations in the taskbar save taskbar thumbnail previews show thumbnails instead of icons show window contents while dragging smooth edges of screen fonts now after that click apply and then ok and guys after that method number 3 is personalize setting for performance right click on your desktop and select personalize under the background section choose either picture or solid color avoid slides how or windows spotlight to prevent lag in the taskbar section hide unnecessary items like research task view widgets and chat if you don't use them disable unused system tray icons and turn off features under device usage so guys after that method number four is uninstall unnecessary apps so go to settings and then go to apps in install apps install application and uninstall those you don't use for example microsoft teams mail and calendar camera etc under advanced app settings turn off share and across devices navigate to startup apps and disable high impact apps you don't need at startup such as microsoft edge or onedrive so guys, the next step is optimize system notification and power settings. Go to settings and go to system, open notification, scroll to additional settings and uncheck. Show the windows welcome experience after updates, suggest way to get the most out of windows, finish setting up this device, under power and sleep set your system to best performance. In the power mode settings so guys after that the next step is adjust game settings navigate to settings and go to gaming game bar and turn off the game bar under graphic settings you need to disable hardware accelerated GPU scheduling unless you have a high-end GPU and find it beneficial enable variable refresh rate Turn off optimization for windowed gamed, playing full screen mode for better performance. In captures, disable all options, enable game mode to optimize background processes while gaming. The next method is disable unnecessary services. Open services by typing it in the start menu. Locate and disable services you don't use such as valid services, valid service, windows insider service and apply the changes by setting the startup type to disable in the properties clear temporary files by typing the following commands one by one in the run dialog 
Windows plus key and here you can type temp and delete all the junk files in the folder or you can type another command percentage temp percentage or another command privilege so guys after that the next method is enhance privacy and security settings go to settings go to privacy and security and in general tab disable all options to prevent tracking and suggestions turn off features in the following sections speech in inking and typing personalization diagnostic and feedback under app permissions disable permissions for apps you don't use by following these tweaks guys you will significantly boost your system performance and fps in games if you found this guide helpful feel free to like and subscribe for more tips let me know in the comments if you have any question and i'll try to help as much as possible so guys we will meet in the next one until then peace out